Hey, nigga, hey, yo. This nigga hot right now, man. This nigga hot right now, y'all. He hot right now, y'all. Oh, shit. He done had foot on neck in his, in his live stream. He got them numbers now, boy. Pardon me. Let me see if them numbers gonna drop down. Hold on. Let me see if them numbers gonna drop. <laughs> Let me see them numbers drop. Let's look and see. Hold on. Hold on. Let's look and see. He over there trying to force foot on neck to choose a side. What type of gay ass shit is this on social media? They got niggas out here doing this shit now. Oh, shit, Mayo. You can't go to that chat, Mayo. You go over there, Mayo. I don't fuck with you. Logos, you better not go to Diet Melon chat. Oh, hell no. Oh, no. Uh-uh, Mimi Organic. You better not go over there to Diva Time, boys. You go over there, I don't fuck with you. Miss Juicy, you, uh-uh, Miss Juicy. You, you better not be over there. You better not be over there in Uncle Shook chat. Yeah, you be over there with Lady Lyra. I'm gonna block you. You guys better not be over there. I'm telling you guys not to go to them people's chat. That's right. I own y'all. I control y'all. That's right. I own you. I own you at Mortal Flip Flops. I own you. I own you. 973 Big D. Big D, you can't go nowhere, Big D. Big D, if I tell you not to go, Big D, you better not go. You better not go, Big D. Go, Big D. You better not go. Stacy, you better not go. I control y'all. Y'all can't go to nobody else chat. Y'all can't do nothing on social media. Y'all can't go nowhere. Big D, I bet not see you like nobody post. 973 Big D, if you like another nigga post on this motherfucker Big D, we gonna fall out today. It more the flip flops, I'm tired of this motherfucking shit. You always going to other people chat, but don't come to my chat. I'm tired of that. I'm tired of that, Eric. Damn. I always go on the other people chat. I'm tired of you, Ashley. You always with that bull ass. You be in other people chat, and I'm tired of you. I'm tired of you, Eli Ash. You always go on the other people chat. Why you always in Grand Grand chat, Eli? Why the fuck you always over there? Why you over there in Lurker chat? Huh? 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 Why you always over there, Mayo? Huh? Tell me that. Tell me that. Why you always messing with them? Why you always listen to Vic Damone? Why you over there listening to him? Huh? Why you talking to them people? Huh? Why you over there liking Vic Damone stuff? Huh? Why you liking ZX 1400 stuff? Why you watching him? Why you over there doing that? I can't stand them people. I hate them. So you can't over there. You can't go over there and like them. No, you can't. You better not go over there. I'm telling you, you better not go. If you go over there, I'm going to block you. I'm going to do everything that I can on social media to you. And I won't like you no more. And I'm going to play with my toys by myself. And I don't give a damn what you say the next day and whatever day that you got to say it. Because I'm going to stick. Play with my toys by my motherfucking self, you bitch ass nigga. That's what I'm telling you. You better not go to nobody chat. Trudy, if I see you in anybody chat, I'm blocking you. Not that McKinney, you go any motherfucking where, I'm blocking you. I control you. I control you, I'm too dope. I control you, Flow, flow Glow. Me, me, organic tea. I control you, girl. You can't go nowhere. You can't, be, you, you can't be listening to me and then go over there and listen to Poitras. Girl, you better pick a side. You better pick a side, girl. That's right. That's right. No, no, no. You cannot put no ones in the chat. You can't do none of that stuff right there. No, because I control you. That's right. I tell you where to go on social media. You can't do nothing. Control you, Mimi. What you talking about? You left Mimi organic because I told you to leave and I told you not to come back. Now you back. That's the only way you can be back because I told you that you could come back. That's all that I'm saying. What type of bitch ass nigga is that? You gonna try to control a motherfucker on, on, on Instagram. This nigga gonna tell foot on neck you got to pick a side. You got to pick a side. What type of shit is that? When did it get to the point that people on social media actually start picking sides? You think I give a damn if you go to somebody else's channel? Shit, bounce. You can go over there and listen to them niggas right now if you want to. You figured that me? Right, I don't need help with nobody with getting a hundred people up in my motherfucking chat. People want to hear that fake ass shit, that water, that watered down ass shit, like straight the fuck up like that. Yeah, 
That's what they do. I get it. He mad. That's all that it is. Him and them cheap ass Dollar General glasses he got on and shit. That tight ass, cheap ass Wade cap and shit. That nigga done sat in there for about two hours picking that lint up out that motherfucking Wade cap. Didn't want to get online and shit. Talking, looking all up in the camera. Yeah, you got to pick a side. You got to pick a side. Nigga, shut your dumb ass up. Nigga, go take your toys and go home. Go play with your toys by your damn self. Yeah, go go play with your toys your damn self. Yeah, oh, oh, chap ass nigga. You don't get mad and shit. Oh, yeah, I'm taking my ball. We be playing basketball. That's the nigga always get the goddamn ball and shit. Yeah, he always get the ball and shit and goddamn want to want to take his shit and go home and shit. Oh, certified whole ass nigga, man. Yeah, want to take his shit and go home. He don't want nobody else to be able to play. Yeah, come on, man. Do this shit every motherfucking day, man. Them niggas be talking about beef and shit. Old ass beef and shit. Yeah. Them motherfuckers be talking about shit older than that beef and shit that be up in motherfucking McDonald's they feeding the niggas and shit. All that human processed ass, GMO ass motherfucking meat, cheap ass motherfucking 99 cent double cheeseburgers and shit. That's the type of shit that they into. These niggas ain't even beef. These niggas is safe a lot beef. I handle all these niggas by my damn self, man. I smash all these niggas single-handedly straight the fuck up with no help whatsoever. Don't need no assistance or none of that. Bruce Lee at this bitch because I know that they faker than a motherfucker. Both of them faker than hell, yo. They'll sit up, hey, look here, they'll sit up and play like they cool with a motherfucker and then try to throw you up under the bus and shit. You ain't seen me out this motherfucker. I ain't made one motherfucking video about no fucking me, me, or again. She left because she fucking left. People said this, people said that. You don't know what the fuck happened to her. You don't know what the fuck happened in a person's life or why the fuck they ain't online and all this shit. Y'all some grown chaps, man. Y'all niggas grown chaps. Oh, oh, now she back. Now, yeah, she back. Okay, and? 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 Man, that nigga can say throw up whatever. If he say anything that got to do with throwing up anything other than regurgitating, that has everything to do with world news. See, these type of people want to ride my coattail. These type of people want my views. These type of people want my following. But these are the type of people that are not making it make sense, y'all. And that's what they don't get. All this beefing, all this drama, all this back and forth shit, this shit ain't getting closer to actually bringing forth some information about Elysio and carbonation. These are the people that's been put in place to cause a distraction. They are here to cause division. They are here to gossip. They are here to shit start and shit stir. That's all the fuck that they gonna do. That's why they be mad at me. They probably like, oh yeah, he tired. Now he ain't gonna hit. Man, I will handle all y'all weak ass niggas all day. Drag your motherfucking ass up and down the street cause I stand on the truth. Clown fuck ass niggas like that retarded ass nigga standing outside with that cheap ass shirt on and shit out there, man. Man, that nigga struggled like a motherfucker to get that shape up right there, man. Yeah, old rusty neck ass nigga and shit, man. Man, that nigga struggling like a motherfucker, man. He mad right now. Mad as a motherfucker. Him and her on that just talking and shit. Then you got the Arona bullshit, uh, uh, fake ass motherfucker person over there. They throwing up the little knives and all that old other shit. Who the fuck cares, yo? Like straight the fuck up. Straight the fuck up. And the person, Capricorn, Jan 14, that was just in my chat, when you see that person come back over here after they get finished over there, just put get them in the chat and I'm going to know and they ass gone too, okay? Yeah, because I see they with the fuck shit too. Yeah, just when you see them, Capricorn, what is it, Capricorn, let me see what it say. Capricorn Jan 14. Okay, yeah. When you see that account, just say get them. That's all you got to do. Just say get them. That's all you got to do. Okay? So when they come back over here, we're going to get their motherfucking ass. All right? We ain't, we ain't going to do no gang stalking shit. We ain't going to do that. We ain't, we ain't, we ain't going to do that. Because we see of on how much that people are clout chasing out here. We see how much that people are in dire need for attention out here. We get that. We see that. You know how many people that sit back and say, hey, yo, man, I'm tired of this. I'm tired of hearing people argue. I'm tired of hearing people beefing every day. That's why I chose not to do that. But then when you got people that's motherfucking tiptoeing around and shit, right, whispering in the dark and shit like Ron Isley and shit or whatever, right, hearing footsteps in the dark and all that shit or whatever, right? When you run across those type of individuals and when you address them, then they ain't got nothing else to say. This dumbass nigga, right? This nigga, 
This nigga so childish, he thought that he was going to make foot on neck, pick a side that she was supposed to reside in. That's fucked up right there when you do that. That's just like saying, oh, okay, grand, grand, who you going to listen to? World, or you going to listen to them? I don't expect her to listen to no damn body. If she decided to go over there and listen to them, hey, that's what the fuck does she do? I don't have the issue with her. I only got the issue with them clowns. That's all that it is. And the reason being, because they doing a lot of pseudo fuck shit, fuck boy, fuck girl stuff on social media right now. I get that 100%. So that's why they got to try to, like, air me out or some shit like that or whatever. I get it, though. You think I'm hurting? No. Because I'm still rocking 73, 74, 72 in my chat while they had 107 people together. See, that's the sad shit. You see, people got to team up and on that old other shit or whatever just to try to team up, you know, like to try to do something against world news or whatever. Am I affected by it? Do I hesitate? In any way, you know, is this taken away from my energy to be able to perform effectively as I've continued to perform, continue to get interviews, continue to conduct flawless live streams online, conference calls, as well as shout my people out at the same time, like Melvin, like Support Jones Financial, like Rose 00978. See, I can do all of that and more because this is what the fuck that I do. I don't go to the, the, the motherfucking auto pause, you know, shopping shit and try to tell them niggas what to do because I don't know what the fuck to do. I know how to change the oil and shit like that, but I don't know how to fix no damn car or no shit. So I can't go over there trying to tell them what to do. That's how I feel when people try to come to my motherfucking channel and tell me what to do. Trust me, I got this. We good over here, okay? I got this shit. I'm going to run it the way that it's supposed to be ran, you see? And when I open up the platform, I do so for people to be able to speak. See, this is what it's all about, engagement. So you can tell that it's people that are dormant. You can tell that it's people that hold their phone too much because in real life, they're not effective communicators. They lack the ability to talk to people. And that's what happens with social media over a period of time when people get caught up in all of the fuck shit that's going on. They'll find themselves in that position where they're not able to comfortably, uh, normally respond and react as they would in everyday, day-to-day life only because they have been dispositioned by social media, by their social media usage, by the gossip they hear on social media. You feel what I'm saying? All of that and more. See, the way that I speak, I have to speak this way to break stuff down. So the people that support me come to me because I do break it down and I do make it make sense. That's what it's all about. Why you have senseless individuals that's online. That's right. You got senseless individuals online. So now I see, right, that this clown, turd ass, gonzo nose ass, fuck boy ass nigga is listening to me while I'm on my live. Damn, you 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 that motherfucking attentive about you bitch ass nigga, gonzo nose ass, fuck boy. What is it about world new? You want to be me, fuck nigga? Huh? Is that what it is? You'll never get to this point. You know why? Because your wave cap too motherfucking tight. You long nose, sign feel, bitch ass nigga. The fuck I'm telling you? You's a clown, moist ass, silly ass, twinkie feeling ass nigga. That's what the fuck that you are. How the fuck you gonna control where a woman gonna go on social media? You don't control shit in that weak ass house you stay in. Fuck boy. Fuck boy. It's going up today. Fuck boy. Fuck boy. The fuck I thought, you weak ass nigga. Yeah, show where you at, fuck ass nigga. Yeah, scary ass nigga. You and them cheap ass Dollar General earbuds you got in your ear. Don't nobody want to hear that weak ass shit over that nigga. That's why y'all listening to me. You know who got the cloud out this motherfucker. You know who got it. That's right. You know who got it. You mad now, ain't you? I know you are. I know you are. Make a video about it, you fuck ass nigga. On your fuck ass, weak ass channel. You moist ass, nature boy, nut loving ass nigga. Look at you, fixing your lips now. You weak ass, watered down, bitch ass, pseudo LL Cool J wannabe, raggedy face ass nigga. You and your girl ass fingernails nigga. Fuck you. Fuck you nigga. Use a hoe. Use a hoe. Use a hoe. Nigga, ain't nobody out this motherfucker wearing no do-rags no more. You broke ass nigga. Pour some money out your pocket with your broke ass. Do that. Why don't you do that, nigga? You don't do nothing but spend your time gossiping with bras all fucking day. That's all that you do. All day. That's what the fuck you get for listening to me, little bitch ass nigga. Yeah, I see. Yeah, I see. I got all kind of devices in this motherfucker. I follow motherfuckers when I don't even know that I'm following. 
Yeah, straight the fuck up. Now, back to my regular schedule programming uh, with these fuck niggas again. Uh, like I say, I just wanted to air him out because uh, they was tuning in uh, to World News. They think that highly of World News. So, you know, I be lifting up skirts of these hoe ass niggas. I, I, I have to do that out here, man. I, 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 I got to, man. I, I can't let y'all get misled out here with the fuck shit, you feel? Man, that nigga got them girl ass fingernails. Man, that nigga girly than a motherfucker. He look like he don't do shit but sit around and picking his toes and shit. Old toe jam, Frito mouth smelling ass nigga. Dumpster juice smelling ass nigga. I already know what type of nigga he You already know he a Rudy Poo nigga. You can look at the nigga how he dress until he broken in a motherfucker. Look at it. He ain't, you ain't never seen that nigga get on here with nothing that was fashionable. Nothing. Nothing, not even his motherfucking shoes, you old broke ass, disgusted ass, cry me a river, Justin Timberlake, can you help me out, pay my phone bill ass, lackluster ass, Randy Watson from coming to America ass nigga, fuck you talking about, get your ass smoke choked on here nigga, you old gossip girl ass, coming on WSOC ass nigga, fuck is you talking about, Lifetime Movie Network ass, snapped ass type of nigga, who you mad at? Who you mad at, mad nigga? Them niggas like that, man. Them the niggas I be throwing tampons at, man. I be trying to throw every goddamn available tampon I can find that poor dude's ass, man. Because he's a bitch. That's what you got to do to little bras, man. You see? And no disrespect to any woman out here who has a menstrual cycle whatsoever. But uh, on the lines of him, yeah, he's a straight up hoe. Yeah, he's a whole lot. He's a coward, too. Yeah, man. Uh-huh. Yeah, man, man, that nigga, hey, look here, man, that nigga, that Superman draw-wearing ass, tidy whitey ass for nature boy up in the camera, cheesing and smiling ass, flirtatious eyes, LL Cool J licking his lips ass nigga, if y'all can't see what that cross-dressing nigga is right there, I don't know what the fuck to tell you, that nigga cross-dressing, yo, that nigga a whole lot cross-dressing, man, I don't even, I don't even fuck with them kind of niggas right there, shit, no, I, 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 I don't fuck around, bro, like, I, I, I be knowing how certain niggas are, man. Yeah, man. You can look at him and tell, man. That nigga metrosexual, man. Yeah, he 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 really pampers himself type of shit or whatever. Yeah, you can look at him and tell, man. That's the type of shit that he do. You see? He he be around all them women trying to get uh health mother you feel me the ghetto report. He be trying to get all type of motherfucking health advice and shit and all that. Nigga, fix your weak ass face. Stop pouting that gonzo ass nose, fuck nigga. Always up in the camera and shit. I can't stand a motherfucker when I talk to him on the video chat and they got their whole goddamn face all up in the motherfucker. Like they ain't never used a smartphone before and shit. I'm like, damn, dumb nigga. Yeah, you actually talking to somebody online. Damn, dumb nigga. I know in your worthless ass life, don't nobody want to talk to you, dumb ass nigga. But damn, you ain't got to be that way with every goddamn body. You just be so excited and every goddamn thing. Man, you go back and look at that live. He was on there with, man, let me pull that live up. That nigga was on there with Pop, man. That nigga was, boy, that was the, man, it was like that nigga, man, that nigga was like a, like a, like a faggot, like a, like a motherfucking punk in prison, man. That nigga was happier than a motherfucker, man. Yeah, smiling and shit. I'm like, damn, you won't even let the man go out with his wife, Pops and Tina out trying to shop his dumb ass, trying to talk on the line. They don't want to talk about no velvet and shit, you dumb ass nigga. Go out and find a motherfucker. Shit. You don't want to talk about this shit over no. That man don't want to talk about that shit, man. He know I don't mean the shit. I, I I say shit about it too. I call her strong jaw and all type of shit. I be joking and shit. I don't mean I don't want nothing bad to happen to her or nothing. Sometimes you gotta give a motherfucker tough love. They know that shit. You don't see them motherfuckers out here making videos and shit. They might got one of them popular troll accounts, but hey, you know how that go. But you know that's how it is, man. Yeah, that's how it is. I, I keep it real, man. I don't I don't play no games like that, man. I don't need no clout chasing motherfuckers around me. I don't need nobody to jump up in my motherfucking life for my shit to be popping, motherfucker. I'm popping in real motherfucking life. I've been popping and goddamn locking, nigga. I ain't lost a motherfucking thing. And, and definitely ain't lost nothing dealing with you nothing ass niggas and you nothing ass bitches like Lurker say. I ain't lost nothing. No, I ain't lost nothing. I, to be honest with you, I'm glad some of you niggas is gone. Yeah. You, 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 you had too many niggas around. Some shit bound to go wrong. Yeah, niggas can't, niggas can't just, just be around each other like that. Not a whole bunch of us. Yeah, we got that warrior energy up in us and shit. Yeah, we, hey, look here. Even the women are alphas, man, when it come to melanated women. They strong. They aggressive. They don't just go for anything. I don't deal with passive motherfuckers. I don't deal with passive channels. I don't deal with passive shit in general. That's why niggas don't like me. 
I get it. I don't want no weak ass woman. I don't even fuck with weak ass niggas. I don't call them my mans and them and shit like that. Nah, I got niggas. I call, they be like, hey, bro, hey, bro, let's go. That's the type of shit I'm into. They don't be on here talking on the internet and shit. This bitch ass nigga gonna be standing outside talking on live, whispering and beef. Take your dumb ass in the house and talk about all that shit. You know why he won't do it? Cause he can't. Cause his, his goddamn baby mama, where the fuck he stay at, ain't gonna let him be in there talking on the goddamn internet like that. You feel what I'm saying? Stop fronting, nigga, for the gram, bro. Come on, man. Take your dumb ass in the house and go live then. This nigga always outside and shit. Yeah, sitting on the porch. She don't want to hear that dumb ass shit you talking about. And you ain't really no stand up nigga anyway, cause you always talking to a bunch of fucking women. Why you ain't add your damn girl, your baby mama to the fucking group? You salamander ass, snake ass, reptilian ass, every opportunity I'm waiting with my mouth open available to be able to capture one of these women ass type of nigga. You's a vampire ass nigga. Cargoyle in the face looking ass nigga. Get the fuck away from me. Sex demon, sex magic ass. Oh, let me uh, motherfucking woo you with my eye. Don't nobody want to see your big pop eyes, oh, rotten face ass, old man looking ass nigga. Get your old ass on, man. You old young nigga look old as a motherfucker, man. Motherfucker all the way outside. You know what I'm saying? That nigga all the way outside. I should told that nigga to walk to the store and get us a uh, get us a cigar. Yeah, go get us a cigar, dumb nigga. Look like that's what you do anyway. Run, boy. Run, run, run like nature, boy. You a run, boy. That's all the fuck you do. Take your dumb ass out there and run around. Baby mama gonna wonder where your ass at. You done been on live this motherfucking long. I wonder what he doing now. What, what is he doing now? Yeah, his dumb ass. He out there talking to Kiss the Veil. He, he ain't think about his baby mama now. Yeah, his steady goddamn talking. Looking all up in the camera and shit. You know what I'm saying? Dumb nigga, man. Dumb nigga. Yeah, that's, that's why the people that was over there, they left. They don't even want to hear that, man. They don't want to hear that stuff, bro. You and them, and you and them 56 viewers, man. That shit already show you, bro. It's in your face for you to see, bro. This is the realization. This is the realest moment for you at this point. It's the realest moment. Yeah, that's real talk. This is the realest moment for you. This will be for your record and archives, fuck nigga. Okay? Add this to all of the fuck boy shit that you got that's in your head right now. Like how you moving your lips and shit around and shit. You was a fuck nigga, bro. Look at you. Who you, who you trying to put on for? Who was you putting on for? Oh my God, see that, that's that broke back mountain shit. That's why I couldn't fuck with you like that. That's why I couldn't even fuck with you like that. Cause you a broke back mountain ass nigga. I couldn't fuck with you like that, man. Yeah, I, I be seeing it in your goddamn eyes, man. You's a simp ass nigga, bro. Yeah, you and that goddamn uh, motherfucking V for Vendetta mass mustache and shit you got, bro. You's a funny ass nigga, bro. Gay blade ass, funny ass nigga. Y'all, look, two of y'all. Y'all some punk ass channel holders. Both of y'all together only can get 52 views. That's some sad ass shit right there. Look at this shit, y'all. This shit is sad. Look. Look at this shit. Y'all niggas is sad, man. Y'all sad in the motherfucker, man. Y'all sad in the motherfucker, man. What the fuck is really going on, man? What y'all got to team up and have gossip about me, man? Oh my gosh, man. Is it that serious, bro? Just took your little dumb ass view. You thought you was doing something when you had foot over there, dick. Foot on neck is a household name, you bitch ass nigga. Not you. You or your fake ass friend that was in love with nature boy that slept in a motherfucking tent in her house. Playing like she on isolation and all this dumb ass shit. Her dumb ass could have got abducted or any goddamn thing. Trying to go over there and be with a coat. Dumb ass nigga. You fun that? You support that? You a fuck nigga for that. Yeah. You better got her ass ran up under the snag somewhere. Just like that damn girl that did that shit that was on the news the other day. You didn't see that shit, Stephanie, that girl played like she got abducted and shit. You don't do no shit like that. You feel me, me, me? Playing like you got motherfucking, you in a goddamn tent. I got all that shit recorded. Her dumb ass in a goddamn tent in the house. See, look, this is what I be doing when I be talking to Bishop. This dumb ass broad gonna play some shit, a nature channel shit, with some crickets in the background and shit. Yeah, her dumb ass. I'm like, look at this dumb ass broad. Man, look me, and, look, me and my wife, we sitting there laughing at this shit. Like, look at her dumb ass. She done went out and bought a sleeping bag and every goddamn thing. We clowning the fuck out of her, asking her and shit. Like, okay, so are you going to, like, 
take it back when you're done with it. She's like, uh, yeah, I got the receipt. We like, you a dizzy ass, bro. Like, what the fuck? What the fuck else will you do? You old actress ass, bro. You a crisis actor that don't even get paid. <laughs> you didn't even get paid for doing that shit. Nature Boy, hey, look, then her dumb ass gonna go on the line with Nature Boy talking about, and, and Bishop, and I'm sorry, and I'm sorry. Who the fuck gonna be apologizing to Nature Boy, y'all? Think about that. You see the PSYOP, y'all? See, you could tell the people that was a part of this shit. They was playing like that they was a part of a group to take Nature Boy down. Her ass wanted to be with Nature Boy, y'all, on there begging. I got the whole live. I'm going to play that shit. She was on there begging, talking about, yeah, Nature Boy, and yeah, and I'm sorry. And I know I just had to tell you, Bishop. I had to tell you. I'm like, look at this dumb ass bro. Her dumb ass on there crying and shit. Hey, Mimi, you remember that shit? I'm like, okay, so you're going to play the whole motherfucking role. You're going to go your dumb ass to Walmart, buy the sleeping bag, and do all that motherfucking shit. Then your big, dumb, retarded ass with your big circle ass head go get on that motherfucker. I'm so, hey, Bishop, and I know Bishop. And I, and I just want to, I just want to, I'm sorry, Bishop. <laughs> That was the worst shit happening to her in her life, Philly Kisses. And you know I'm not lying, sis. And you know you've been on every channel, Philly Kisses. You know I'm not lying. That was the weakest shit I ever heard in my fucking life. Hey, Chris Santana, I was like, is she really going to do this right now? Is this dumbass bra really going to get up on here and start fake crying? I, hey, wait till y'all hear the recording of her ass fake crying. Then, foot on neck, you can hear what the fuck she was saying about you. You can hear all... All of the shit, how she threw your ass up under the bus. I'm going to play that shit today. Since you talking shit, you and Poitras over there. I'm going I'm to show her ass today, stupid motherfuckers. All that shit you said about foot. No, because the only thing she was doing it was trying to expose her Mystic Life Village. That's all we was doing. That's all we was talking about. We was just trying to take down. And See, I ain't going to say the rest, but that's what the fuck you said, though, you dumb ass bro. I knew you was full of shit. That's why I recorded you. This is the proof. This is the evidence that everybody need that you ain't shit. You or that weak ass nigga. Ain't man one of y'all hitting on shit. I can comfortably say that. I was I would drag y'all ass on this motherfucker. Straight the fuck up. Still flaming they motherfucking ass, Ling. I ain't playing. Finish and get you another motherfucking six piece wing. Nah, fuck that shit. Don't be trying to run my name up under the motherfucking bus. Fuck you and the motherfuckers that roll with you in that weak-ass motherfucking chat. We'll go over there and swoop through that motherfucker you keep playing. It'll be a whole bunch of ones coming through that motherfucker. Straight like that on command. That's right. And it ain't no, I control the people that's on my channel. No, they fucks with me and we move all in together. Just like your ass when you thought you was going to be with Nature Boy and you thought you was going to be with Carbonation. Why don't you tell everybody that, huh? Why don't you tell everybody that, huh? What you mad at Lurker for? Oh, because she always call him Bishop, and I think it's something with that, because she always, oh, you want me to play that so Lurker can air your motherfucking ass out? Huh? Well, shut the fuck up. Big ass head, bro. Keep on with the shit. You already know I put all y'all ass on me. Come on with the shit. All right, air your ass out on this motherfucking YouTube. You will be, hey, you will delete every motherfucking account on here. You had lurking and wanting to jump on your motherfucking ass, all that shit you been talking. They want to jump on your ass. Keep on running your mouth. Long as you employed to sit over there, y'all just going to make it worse for yourself. That's all you doing. Keep on. Keep on. Come on with it. That's what I'm talking about. Yes, sir. I got time today. I will let them hear this shit. Oh, you sold for granny, huh? Oh, okay. Oh, real? Oh, okay. Oh, don't make me goddamn send her this live and I'll play that shit and let you hear what the fuck you said about Grant. So you better shut your weak ass mouth the fuck up, Tierra. You and that broad ass nigga over there. Keep on running your mouth. Keep running your mouth. We'll make it hot out here. Uh-huh. We'll see for real who been talking shit then. Uh-huh, ha, 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 ha. Okay. That's what I'm talking about. That Fix your face. That's right. Fix your face and keep doing nails. That's what you better keep doing. You know how I play, so don't do that, okay? Keep doing your nails, okay? Keep keep on doing your nails. Keep doing your nails, okay? Yeah, that's the best thing for you to do. Yeah, keep doing that. Every everything gonna be cool, all right? Yeah, you mad? Your ass gonna your ass gonna probably go to motherfucking sleep, mad too, ain't you? Huh? You probably go to sleep, mad, ain't you? You be alright though. Yeah, you be alright. 
this what the fuck happens when you start talking shit. See, I wasn't talking about none of y'all motherfuckers, period. I knew it was going to be two dumb motherfuckers. I knew it for the, for the year was over with. So now I'm going to do a carbonation countdown and I'm going to do a kiss the veil countdown. I'm going to do that too for all the people that subscribe to her and that fake ass crying. You're going to get to listen to how she threw foot on neck up under the bus and all the people she talked about black cherry and I, okay, bitch, today your day. All right. I got your ass today. Okay, I'm going to see then what the fuck y'all say. See, I tried to save your little dumb ass. I'm going to see what y'all got to say today after this right here. I got your ass today. You know what it is, too. Oh, you remember that conversation? Oh, yeah, you talked big shit about everybody. You talked about everybody, did you? You remember that? You remember that? You thought I was outside walking. You know why you thought I was outside walking? Because I had the background that I recorded of being outside walking. I really was sitting in the house recording your dumb ass, okay? Okay? Remember that day when we was talking and it sounded like it was raining? It wasn't raining. I was sitting in the garage with a recording of raindrops, okay? That's what that was. Okay? You're not smarter than me. Stop it. I've been out here in these streets. You're not smarter than me. Not, nope, nope, not at all. Not at all. You know why you're not smarter than me? Because you even gave me the idea when you used the cricket sounds, you know, when you played like you was in the sleeping bag. You remember that? Remember when you used them cricket sounds and shit? <laughs> you remember that shit? Oh, okay. How much did they give all your money back when you um, went to Walmart, when you exchanged the sleeping bag and shit? Did they give it all back? Did you have a trusty decoder ring? Did you have that too? Oh, okay. I just was wondering. I mean, you know, because you was keeping it hot. I said, well, damn, you went all, you pulled out all the stops, did you? Yeah, I got to, I got to make Bishop think this. I got to make Bishop think this. I got I got to make Bishop think this right here. This is what she going to do, y'all. Look. Yes, and the, and, and the fat fat. You know how she talked with that list. Yes, Bishop. Yes, and I know because my dessert taste is. Yes, and, and I've been sleeping in the tent. Yes, I know, I know. I know you don't like big girls. I know you don't like big girls, Chief. I'm going to slim down, Chief. I'm doing the V6 diet. With your dumb ass. I already know. Oh, yeah. I already know. That what you were doing, uh, Kiss the Veil. That what you were doing with. Uh, okay. Uh, peace Reflection. Ain't that what you was doing? Playing with Nature Boy? See, you would play with a motherfucker, too. See what I'm saying? You would play with a motherfucker life, too. Straight like that. That's why your ass getting smoke choked today. And, and shout out to Jazzy. And who don't like motherfucking Jazzy being in my chat? You can get the fuck up out of my chat. That's how that's going to go, okay? Yeah, don't. I, and we're going to do that over here. If you don't like Jazzy, you better not like Jazzy, but put it and don't put it in my comments. Because if you put it in my comments, I'm on your ass next, okay? That's how that's going to go. Now, it's going to go all the way the fuck down because you got people out here lying, creating shit, starting drama, getting motherfuckers to fall out with people and all type of shit. I'm ready for the rest of this shit to come out now. Since the major shit starter and her bullshit ass gonzo nose boyfriend want to talk shit all fucking day. Yeah, we're going to let the motherfucking record play. And we're going to get to hear all of the shit that Kiss the Veil was talking about, everybody. That's what the fuck that we're going to do, okay? That's what we're going to do. Yeah, since you done brought it up, I wasn't out here on no beef shit. No, I don't think I've been in a, a, a I ain't been in a, a entertaining beef since Jazzy G. Yeah, I, was, I graduated from that shit. Yeah, we went on our separate ways and shit. Tell them, Jazz, we don't do that shit. Damn. See, y'all other motherfuckers is just clout chasing. Now y'all want to try to do it. Now you want to talk about something. Now it's this. Now it's this. And all that other shit. But we know what it is, though. Hey, yes, Chief. Yes, Chief. I, I, I learned the five sizes, Chief. And I'm through with my debilitations. And, and I'm almost through with my isolation period. Uh, and, and, and as soon as she get off the phone with Chief, this how she be. Oh, oh, listen. Ooh, foot girl. Ooh, 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 foot girl. Listen, foot. Ooh, listen, foot. Ooh, girl, you ain't gonna believe us. Ooh, girl. Ooh, I got, ooh, girl, I got the key. Girl, I got it. Foot, I got it, girl. Foot, foot on neck. You ain't gonna believe us, girl. You ain't gonna believe us. Oh, you ain't gonna believe us. Oh, yeah, I got Bishop. I got Bishop on a recording. Uh-huh. And Bishop said this, but I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna talk about the part where I show Bush, Bishop my titties, though. But I will tell you all of the other stuff, though. If you got...
got a person that'll go spend their money and go buy a sleeping bag and play like they're going to be a part of a cult that gets absolutely no information whatsoever. The mission should have been aborted, dumbass. It should have been aborted. You didn't do nothing. You didn't accomplish nothing. You didn't get no further than me actually interviewing people that are former members of Carbonation and Melanation to, to, to keep it real. You didn't do shit, nothing. But you claim like you supposed to be a household name and all this other stuff. You and that gonzo nose ass nigga looking like a, a black ass Seinfeld and shit. Yeah, you and him. You think you supposed to get like some credit or whatever? You ain't done half of the shit that these channel holders out here done did. Don't nobody want to hear that shit? Because you talk to nature boy, lying ass motherfucking brother with his crack smoking ass. Don't nobody care nothing about that. His broke ass. Stand up under that woman with that funny ass body. Don't nobody care nothing about that shit, dude. Straight the fuck up. That ain't no motherfucking success story. Yeah, she was supposed to be the mole, but she was in love with nature, boy. She wasn't no motherfucking mole. Because uh, all of the moling and information that she got, who does she report that back to? Is there anybody that's willing to raise their hand and uh, say that they got any audio of nature, boy, or any pictures or any background sounds of Tron getting his butthole hit or nature, boy, smacking Aya or Ra or nature, boy, being with Pisces uh, I ain't heard none of that right there we gonna start the church up in this motherfucker we gonna start the church the black screen God we gonna black screen this motherfucker today yes right let's go we going to the church we is going to the church yes sir yes sir uh, we got to go there. Ha. I gathered you all here today ha, to talk about a girl that played in a sleeping bag. Registration. The one that played like she wanted to be in combination. Her and her boyfriend that ain't contribute nothing. Both of them lied out here on IG. Uh -huh. They started a lot of arguments, yes. They caused a lot of people to fall loud. I swear they did one time. Let me get a one up in that motherfucking chat. One time, I tell you, the sister McLaren bring my napkin over here. I tell you, a whooper, they mad at all the channel holders, a whooper. They mad at Jazzy G, cause she talking about nature, boy. I they mad at foot on neck, bitch, cause she a household name and velvet calls out a name. Oh, and she mad at the lurker and everybody else for helping folks out there. She even wanted to assert herself into the drama and that bitch ass nigga over there and with that big ass nose named Poetress. He is a bitch ass nigga if I ever seen one. Uh, always hanging around the women and talking and carrying on and uh, starting everything out here on Instagram and always up in people business and playing like he ain't got nothing to do with everything that ain't got nothing to do with nothing. Uh, yes, I tried on one time to leave that old nigga alone. Uh, him and that old big head old girl that slept out there in that sleeping bag. Uh, uh, she get online and play like she big and bad, uh, but she went there and played herself and talked to Master Chief Elysio, the master teacher, uh, and I know that she was in love with him. Uh, uh, every day she talking about Bishop. Uh, she mad at Lurker because she called him Bishop. Uh, she really done snaked out Grand Grand too with all that talking, and she threw Black Cherry up under the bus, uh, uh, and she kept 
going on and on and talking about people. Uh, and she mad at me because of my YouTube channel. Don't you be mad, kiss the veil. It's going to be all right, little girl. Uh, uh, and I told you to stop fucking with me. Uh, uh, and I told you how hard in the paint that I go. And I tell you, sister, don't you keep jumping around over there like that. Them big ass titties going to pop all the way the fuck up out of that bra. And I'm still motherfucking looking to her. Uh, and I'm going to make sure that I let my peoples know whether it's the Bible or the five sciences. I'm going to be on that motherfucking ass. Uh, and you can get mad about it. Uh, whether it's on YouTube or Instagram. Uh, you know why? Because I'm a channel holder and I keep content and I got to create it. Uh, y'all niggas want to make content out of me. Uh, and y'all niggas want to say my name And y'all niggas want to keep me up in your shit Sister Mary, why you over there? Stop looking at me with all that flirtatious shit up in your eyes Cause I've been your ass over at the church service And just like the way that I be smashing these motherfuckers I hear in the YouTube streets that be trying me With that motherfucking beef shit We a roast the fuck up out of your weak ass, all right, and because we know that you ain't about shit, all right, and then you're gonna be in everybody motherfucking chat, just talking, and talking, and talking, and talking, all right, people thought I was mad at Jazzy G, all right, I told Jazzy G just the other day, Jazzy, get back on your commentary, don't you get caught up with all that shit, all right, cause there's too many people beefing out here, all right. All up on a YouTube, every channel that you turn on, people arguing, and I don't know why. And all of the white folks is just sitting back and laughing. All right, I ain't trying to get you fired at your job, but if you do get fired, you can hit me up, and I'll at least talk to you for a little bit. All right, I can't put you back in another job, all right, but I can put you in a different state of mind. That's all that I can do, and I'll go all out for. You, and I'll be your friend Just don't try to cross me up Cause a lot of people did it before So I stay up on my toes And I record everything And I go hard in the pain And if a motherfucker wanna try me I smoke choke your ass out again, alright And the service ain't over Deacon, you better play that motherfucking shit You better play it, my nigga The string eyes. stops are especially. I know. I know. I know. Yeah, get on your motherfucking shit. That's that, that what the fuck you need to do. Okay. All right. We're going to get back to this preaching shit and stuff and all that. Night. Okay. Yeah. Hand me that shit. Okay. Thank you. I got you. Play the homies. Yeah. But like I was saying, these niggas is still out here fucking with me. All right. And I got to keep going hard in the paint. All right. And they thought that the dragging and the roasting was over. Nah, you bitch ass nigga. Poor just, I'm going to stay on your ass. All right. And kiss the veil. You going to get this work too. Because your ass is over there lying. And your ass been envying me. And your ass been hating on me. You ain't got to hate on me. All right. You can get your own following, all right? You ain't got to say my motherfucking name. You ain't got to try to insert yourself in no beef. Just keep it real. That's all you got to do. That's why the people, they, they come and get at me the way that they do. And everybody right now, uh, everybody that's up in here, if you can feel the power, you can feel the spirit of the Lord. Put them ones up in that motherfucking chat. Put them in the chat, Sister Mary. Put them up in there, uh, Sister Digital. Uh, put them up in there, Sister EDB, alright, put them up in there, sister Trudy Smalls, I don't want to see nothing but ones, and the ones is just like the collection plate, let me see the participation, and the people that fuck with me, cause they know they can't fuck with me, no, I, they don't want the beast to come out, alright, they want me to dox they ass, and put their house online, and all of their information, but no, because I'm better than that, alright, I'll make sure 
sure that I address your bitch ass. And I'll make sure that everybody know about it. So we don't have to talk about this bitch ass shit no more. Thank you, Philly Kisses. Thank you, sister. God, God bless you, Rose. The next? Mimi Organic. Bless you. Bless you. Bless you, sister. Okay. Yes, sister. Bless you. Uh-huh. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, make money, not friends. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes, sun drops. Not your average girl. Yes, hallelujah. Carbell, hallelujah. Let me best life, hallelujah. Yes, yes, I know. In meditation. I know, I know, I know. I know, I know, I know we're going to get to the point where we can be able to get past our debilitations. Yes, we will, people. We will be able to do it together, y'all. We're going to be able to do it together, y'all, okay? It's going to take us to, hey, look, it's going to take all of us to clean these streets up. It's going to take all of us, whether we have to joke on each other and roast each other, or if I got to get up on this motherfucker and dance, okay, choir? I don't want nobody being in no bad mood. I don't want nobody being twisted all out of shape. I want everybody to be able to come up in the place and have a good time, okay? Okay, sister, and I ain't forgot about them big old titties jiggling over there, too. I'ma still get at you. Hey, but like I say, you guys make sure that you enjoy yourself uh, and you take good care of yourself and uh, you don't entertain all that gossip and uh, stuff all up in them inboxes and stuff like that. Praise the Lord. Praise him. Praise him. Yes, 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 yes. Praise, praise him. Praise, 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 sister. We're going we to have a worshiping session up in here, okay? The we final. will. We will have a session, okay? Oh, yes. Thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you. Don't tell us up in the air. Don't tell us up in the air. Oh, Gabriel. Oh, Michael. Oh, bring it up out of you. That's what I'm talking about right there. Get them demons up out of you. That's what I'm talking about right there. Hey, man, get them demons up out of you. That's what I'm talking about. You supposed to read your Bible, read your Quran, pray to your higher power. Bring it all to the Lord. Don't bring that stuff over here to IG. <laughs> I see you, Sister Keisha. I've been seeing you, Sister Keisha, for twice. Anyway, let me get back on track. Okay. Oh, but anyway, like I'm telling you, don't you get caught up in the things that you're doing, okay? Leave that stuff alone. Don't you entertain none of that stuff. Don't you get caught up in it. Somebody got an issue. They need to go directly to the person they got a problem with. Y'all stop tattletelling. Y'all stop starting stuff. Y'all stop creating stuff. Because stuff really can get bad. Okay? You see? No one wants to reveal your innermost secrets and your deepest, darkest, whatever the fuck it is that you're dealing with. Don't nobody want to do that stuff right there. You see? I be out here trying to have fun. You see what I'm saying? See how my channel regulated and set up is fun and information. And fun formation. You feel me? That's what the fuck that it is. So I try to keep it like that. I don't try to base my date talking about dry snitching ass, 52 fake out ass, Dr. Magoo ass, gumshoe ass, uh, gumshoe on Nintendo with the orange gun shooting ass niggas. I don't do that. I don't do that. So then when I come out here on the forefront and when I address individuals, I do so accordingly. You see? Don't ever put me in anybody beef, okay? So when I tune in to certain people and I don't comment, the reason I don't comment, because most of y'all are so fucking one-dimensional that if you see somebody comment in somebody's chat, you automatically say, oh, they rock with each other. Oh, 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 she down with that purse. Oh, she down with that purse. See, ain't now one of y'all motherfuckers out here gonna tell me I can't be in Jazzy chat and that I can't be in Lurker chat. I can be in any motherfucking body chat that I wanna be in. 
Anybody chat, I choose to be in. Wherever I go, I go anywhere. I go anywhere. I occasionally stop through, cuss I another ass out, say some shit in the comments, and I'm gone. You see, I go wherever the fuck I want to go. I don't worry about motherfuckers saying, oh, okay, well, fuck that then. I'm about to get at this. Okay, well, get at me then. Okay, I'll be right here waiting on you. When you when you feel like getting at me, I'll, I'll be waiting on you. Matter of fact, I'll screen record it. We'll go on your show, and I'll screen record it. You figure them? We'll do it like that. See, the reason why I didn't go on dude's show, because I knew what it was. See, you got to think about this. The reason why he wanted foot on neck in his live, because if foot on neck hit the live button, and somebody see that she's live, they going up in there. You see what I'm saying? Because they know that she's talking about something. It's not going to be foot on neck on this motherfucker, uh, uh, motherfucking folding clothes and shit. She's not going to be doing that. It's going to be something that she's talking about. You figure deal me? That's how they go. You see? So that's why he wanted to get her in his chat. That's all, that's what it's all about, man. Period, point blank. You see? You got to recognize the transparent shit when it's put right in front of your face. See, people will create fake beefs and they'll do a lot of pseudo ass shit just to get some views. See what I'm saying? And, and that's what they do. That's what they do. And that's what they're going to say. Oh, you fake. You this and you that because you listen to world news. OK, are you fake and all of that when you listening to them? Because I'm, I'm seeing a bunch of fake ass shit coming from that little area right there. I see a bunch of fake ass shit to tell you the damn truth. I don't know people that's on social media. You see what I'm saying? That's manufacturing these fake ass beefs. I hear falling out. Motherfuckers be friends with each other and shit. They on here playing like they done beefed and shit. Man, I get that shit. I'm going to tell you like this right here. When me and Jazzy was beefing, it wasn't shit that me and Jazzy had to fucking talk about. It wasn't nothing to talk about. So if I'm beef, I don't have no cool. Look, it ain't going to be no cool, relaxed conversation and all that. Soon as you see me, that's what the I'm from the 704. That's what it is. Ain't no motherfucking you going to get your brother. I don't give a fuck. Get who the fuck ever. Long as they got in their mind and they know what they going to do because I know what the fuck I'm going to do. My track record long as fuck. So it ain't going to matter to me. Yeah, I, what the fuck ever. OK, so it's a lot of people that are not convicted. It's a lot of people. You see what I'm saying? That are not able to rest well at night knowing that they did a bunch of fuck shit low key to people that they play like that they rock with. That's why they do this shit. That's why they always got to tell lies. That's why they always got to spread gossip because see, they got a lot in gossip to cover up all of the fuck shit that they done did. But I don't forget, though. All facts, 47704. And see, that's what I'm talking about. See, y'all motherfuckers act like when you fall out with somebody, right, you're supposed to be mad at them and shit forever. See, that's how I can tell growing up that y'all motherfuckers really haven't been through any real situations. I can imagine a lot of you haven't been homeless. I can imagine a lot of you haven't, like, experienced or faced death. You know, from a firsthand experience, I can tell you really don't give a fuck about your life. And I'm not saying that on no fuck level. I'm just keeping it real because I can tell you don't appreciate nor value friendships because of the shit that you fucking do. You do this shit over and over again. I see people do this shit and I'll be like, you know what, man? Who the fuck gonna fall out next? I'll be like, okay, now who, who? I'll be I'll be going through channels and I'll be like, okay, now who gonna fall out next? And I'll sit there and just watch it. And, and, and I'll be like, damn, I want to go in the chat and say something. But if I do go in here and say something, I don't want to be implicated in no shit. And I don't want to have to fuck nobody up. You know what I'm saying? So I'm like, you know what? Let me just chill or let me hit this person up, you know, like on some G shit. Because when I hit Jazzy up, it wasn't on no shit. Like I was telling her, like, you know, hey, you need to stop doing this. You need to stop doing that. Nah, man. When you see like the repetitiveness of shit that go on, you have to grow to the point to say, you know what, I'm about to chill out with this shit. You know what I'm saying? All right, okay, all right, all right, what up? Because whether you know it or not, it's not just the people that you know of that listen to you. Man, this motherfucker's listen to me. I don't even know him, man. I don't even know him, man. I had a motherfucker at the store the other day that was like, man, for real, man, because I had the shirt on. And they were like, that's you for real. I was like, yeah. He was like, for real. I was like, yeah. You know what I'm saying? He's like, can I take a picture? I was like, hell no. I was like, nigga, I ain't no motherfucking celebrity, dog. I was like, hell no. You don't need no fucking picture, dog. You know what I'm saying? Like, what the fuck is this? We can smoke a blunt together or something. You know what I'm saying? But no, nah, fuck no. I'm regular. You understand? Like, I can have 400 people on my live, but I can still accept your motherfucking uh, message that you sent. You can type shit in my chat. I'm not that fucking busy. 
I'm, I look at here. I, I look, man. I can rub my stomach. You see what I'm saying? Pat my head and all that shit at the same time. You figure that me? So when people say stuff like that, I really have to question, you know, like their level of intelligence and I have to question their motor skills. Like what you're saying is that you can't see what the fuck is going on. I don't have to have no moderators on my channel to tell you the damn truth. I'm, I'm keeping it real with because I see everything. I can do that shit. I can talk and see shit. Look, I can listen, bro. I can comprehend without all of the extra shit now it's some people that need assistance like you've noticed people who are like legally blind you know they have to have you know the dog with them and stuff you know what i'm saying that's a sign to them and stuff you know so they can get through the world or whatever see i'm like motherfucking what's that nigga name the book of eli and shit with jamie fox i don't need like nobody walking with me and all that old other shit you see whatever it is that i gotta deal with you see i'm willing to face that it don't really make a fuck and that's what people seem to have a problem with. And if it was a platform that was set up on social media for people that beef out and they got issues with each other, where they could come to an, you know, like an agreeable, communicatable, or excuse me, a communicable, you know what I'm saying, a talking level or whatever, right? You know, if it was a spot like that, I guarantee you over 85% of the people that's running their motherfucking mouth would not show up because they not about that shit, yo. They not about it, yo. I can I can already tell. I can tell how, how y'all move, man. You can listen to the type of curse words and the context that people put things in sentence and it'll pretty much give you a definitive understanding of the person and where they at mentally, yo. Like, real talk. You can just listen and tell, man. You can look at, yo, real talk. That's right. That's real talk. And if, and if somebody get at me on some other shit, I'm going to be like, you know what? Uh, okay, all right, word. Okay, all right. Let's try to work this shit out or whatever. See, I'm always the bigger person, you know, in the situation. You feel what I'm saying? I, I don't want to do it on that level right there. You see, because I had people, you know, that get online like that gay ass, gay VP nigga that we done motherfucking muted out and shit. That bitch ass nigga get up here. And, and, and motherfuckers say all this dumb ass shit. This nigga say I'm a, a sex offender and all this shit. Now, who was the one person aside from people that I fuck with to go in the chat and then say you lying like a motherfucker, Jazzy? See what I'm saying? See how that worked right there? See, when a person is outright, downright, outlandishly telling a fucking lie, it don't make a fuck who call a spade. It's still a fucking spade. Or uh, you can call a spade disparaging. Or call a spade a nigga. You feel what I'm saying? Either way, it's all the fucking same. And me, as a youth, I played spades for years. I think I played spades from age eight all the way up to I was a fucking adult. But once I learned what the word spade meant, I never in my life will play a game of spades. Nor will I be a part of playing spades. I'm not the duke. I'm not in the club. I'm not Jack. I'm not none of that motherfucking shit. And I damn sure is not the fucking bishop. This is not a fucking chessboard and all of that shit. This ain't no EA Sports, a simulated game. This is not the holographic universe. This is the real world when you don't work or you don't hustle or you don't do what you do. You don't fucking eat. This is the world that I fucking live in. I don't know about the world y'all niggas come from. That's how I can tell you never been through shit. Your ass ain't never had to go without. Your ass ain't never been in no tough situation before. You know why? Because the way of on how that you illustrate the things that you got and how much that you have and all this shit and all that. Like this one damn girl on my friend list. You know, she's an attractive woman or whatever. I told her the other day. I was like, God damn. Every time you own this motherfucker, the only thing you do is post pictures. I was like, you must be a lonely motherfucker, yo. And she hit me up in the DM. I show it to you. I was like, you must be a lonely motherfucker because all you do is post fucking pictures. You don't never go live or no shit like that. But you expect for all of the men, because your ass fat, to come over there and like your pic. I refuse. Fuck that. Whatever motherfucking low self-esteem you got, you're going to continue to have that shit. I'm not getting ready to boost your motherfucking ego by going over there and liking all the motherfucking pictures. And I just sit there and looked at her and I was like, yo, man, this shit is sad, man. Like, like she feel like in order, you understand, to be esteemed or to feel elated, you understand, that she got to do this online. You feel me? And I'm just like, hey, yo, shorty, hold on for a minute. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Check this out. Number one, this is how we move. Okay? This is how, this is how we move in number one. Period, point blank. 
and the black screen gone. I'm back. Fuck them niggas, man. We in here.